As we made our way through the streets of Tombstone, it felt like it could have been 1880. Other than the modern clothing most of us were wearing, the town looked original. From stagecoaches to cowboys to saloon girls, Tombstone had it all. We were interested in one thing, the gunfight at the OK Corral, and we quickly found where to purchase our tickets. We made our way to the corral where animatronics reenacted most famous gunfights in American history. The gunfight at the OK Corral. The gunfight at the OK Corral occurred just two years after Tombstone was established. Over here it tells who they are, Tom McClory, Frank McClory, Ike, and Billy. So I think Ike was the only one who survived and all four, the Earps and Doc survived. Here, we entered a room that was ripe with history and included some old Indian photographs. The Chinese were also very influential in Tombstone, with a population that had grown to over 200 in its prime. Tombstone also had a football team. We're making our way to Doc Holliday's room where Doc's girlfriend had come for a visit. Doc's girlfriend witnessed over 30 shots being fired before three men lay dead and others injured. This Apache woman's nose was cut off. Geronimo surrenders. Actual footage. Geronimo spent the last 23 years of his life as a prisoner of war following their surrender. Geronimo and the Chiricahuas, including the Apache Army Scouts that had helped catch him, were condemned to manual labor at army camps in Florida. Geronimo died in 1909, Fort Sill, Oklahoma. Marshall White's office. Local jail. On the streets of Old Tombstone. There's Johnny Ringo. Yeah.
thieves and stagecoach robbers. I mean, we are horse thieves. Just Billy, 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 hey, Billy, Billy, hey. <laughs> Nobody likes you. <laughs> well, what do we do now? It's simple, you moron. When New Yorkers get here, we deal with them. What's wrong with you? You don't know I mean we're actually gonna kill them, do you? Actually, Billy, see, we're gonna do nothing violent like that. Okay. See, we're gonna go down to the epitaph. All right. Put an angry car in the paper, big fancy border. I get that. Uh, we're gonna kill them. We gotta pay for what they've done. That's a bad idea. We can just go back to Texas. They have great cattle in Texas. We'll leave when we're done. Yeah. Yeah. Cowboys were looking for a fight. Now you've got it. Pop your hands, boys. We're here for your guns. Hold, I don't want that! Indian Bill, 
believe the rocks were piled on to keep animals from digging them up. There's money on that one. George Johnson hanged by mistake, 1882. He was right, we was wrong. We strung him up, and now he's gone. The graves of Tom McClory, Frank McClory, and Billy Clanton. It says they were murdered in the streets of Tombstone. They tried to charge Wyatt and the Earps with murder. Let's go down here and see this one that's fenced off. Try to find out why. In memory of Frank Bowles. She passed by, remember that your so once was I, as I am you, soon you will be remembered. We're looking now for Marshall White, who was shot, killed by Curly Bill. The streets of Tombstone. Marshall Fred White died in 1880. Rest in peace, Marshall White. Here lies Lester Moore, four slugs from a 44. No less, no more. Here is another grave surrounded by a cage for whatever reason. Mrs. Stump, 1884. Maybe the family paid for the... Again, they had to worry about animals digging them up. Some unknown. Unknown, unknown. A lot of unknown, yes. Look at this. That is so cool. Almost looks like a person standing there, doesn't it? This is different. Boot Hill, it was on a hill. 